According to the head of Wagner, the ongoing struggle between Russia and Ukraine could last three more years. Depending on the objectives Moscow actually pursues in it, may last for up to three more years. Jagny Progressin, the creator of the Wagner Private Military Force, has claimed that the billionaire made these claims while speaking with Simeon Pogoth for the War Gonzo project. As previously indicated, if we need to cover the terrorists of the recently merged Donetsk and Lugansk People's Republics with Russia, we will need to work for at least another year and a half or two. Prigozhin warned that if Russia attempts to cross the Dnieper, a significant river that roughly divides Ukraine into two halves, the conflict could continue for up to three more years. At the same time, the founder of the private military organization noted that the destruction of the enemy's army is always a prerequisite for victory. Priority must be placed on this rather than a desire to annex enemy territory. Prigozhin also disclosed, allegedly in jest, that he already has a flawless plan in place should Moscow attempt to stretch over all of Europe into the English Channel. In order to accomplish this, everyone in Russia would have to give up their leisure time activities. Put on their work clothes and work relentlessly, but some of the campaign spoils, such as France, Italy, Bulgaria, and something else, should be distributed to Ukrainians later because they will suffer much more alongside us in 2014. Prior to last year, Pregazin denied having any connections to the organization and its existence altogether. Wagner has primarily worked as a security contractor in Africa and the Middle East. The organization has taken a direct part in the ongoing conflict in Ukraine. With the United States designating Wagner as a transnational criminal organization last month, the accomplishments have also drawn attention to the company-wide international.